Hey YouTube Club members, it's me Monkey Chicken here, and uh, the topic of today's video is Advanced Warfare, the new micro DLC, release dates, and information about it. And with that, let's go and begin. Okay guys, so uh, apparently Sledgehammer just wanted to drop a freaking random amount of micro DLC on us. Usually they like to hype these things up, they like to put all this kind of stuff out there, get hype trains and stuff. Like in uh, Black Ops 2, they even did a voting system, which cameras would you want for only to release a certain amount of them. And of course they released them all towards the end of the life cycle. But um, anyways, yeah, a whole bunch of micro C, uh, micros DLC just dropped. So let's go and talk about those stuff that no one really cares about really first, uh, just to get it out of the way. Um, the, these camos, which are going to be for your nationality, you can put whatever flag you want on there. Um, they are separate if you wanted to buy like the US flag, and uh, that one's going to be $1.99. I'm sorry, I don't know what it is, transferred into Microsoft points or into um, other prices around the world, but that's what it is in USD, $1.99. And yeah, you can buy this one or you can get like a Canadian one and you guys know the rest. They're, they're all the freaking same. They're all the same freaking thing. It's going to be an XOC with your flag on it or whatever nationality that you wanted to put the flag on there. So yeah, awesomeness. No surprises there. Anyways, um, let's move on to the stuff that everyone really wants to talk about. The super awesome gun camos and things. Um, so the first one we're going to be talking about is the Lightning Premium. And really quickly, I just want to say this pack, you're able to kind of split up in a way. Um, if you just want to buy the gun and uh, the player card with the reticles, you're able to buy that for $1.99. It just separately by itself, nothing else. Um, if you wanted to get the exosuit with the helmet and the gun camo with the player card and the reticles, then that would be a total of $3.99, which so $4, all that kind of stuff. You know, taxes and all that kind of stuff. Anyways, um, yeah, you're not able to unfortunately get these exosuits by themselves. You have to buy it in the bundle with the gun for $4, but you are able to get the gun camos and the player cards and stuff for just by itself with the $1.99, which is kind of cool. And uh, really quickly, I would just like to say, um, this is animated right here as you guys can see on the video on the screen and really quickly I just want to say this is a my funnage uh, This is from a youtuber chaos Silencer. Unfortunately, this stuff isn't on PS so I don't have any footage of it But yeah, as you can see it's animated. It's pretty freaking awesome. That's really cool And uh, yeah, let's move on to the next one uh, the nanotech one this one as far as I'm aware of is animated I haven't found any footage of it. I searched it up in like the limited amount of time that I have and uh, I haven't found any footage, but as far as I'm aware of all of them are anim animated, I apologize. That's uh, that's what I've heard so far. It looks kind of cool, and it's the same price point once again. You can get the gun camo and all that stuff um, for $1.99. If you want to get the exit and helmet with all that stuff, then it would be a total of $3.99. Um, let's move on to the next one, probably the next best one. Uh, the magma, which is so freaking cool. It's fire and stuff. You could probably wonder why. Maybe it's the inner dragon to me, but I find it so freaking awesome. It's, once again, it's the same price point, all that kind of good stuff. It's pretty freaking cool. And let's move on to my favorite, the creature pack. This one is super awesome, probably because it's all scaly and stuff, and it's super cool. I really like it, and maybe it's because my favorite color is green. I don't know, but I absolutely love this pack. It's so freaking cool. Same price point once again. Um, animated once again. Um, this footage is once again by Chaos Silencer. Like I said earlier, unfortunately, I don't have any footage of it because I don't have an Xbox. Anyways, it's pretty freaking cool. I love the sludge effect. That's so freaking awesome. Ah, oh, that's so cool. Anyways, guys, let's move on to the next thing, which is the premium packs. So the premium packs are going to be different from the previous packs that we were talking about before. Uh, these are going to be $2.99, $3, and they're just going to be the access suits. There's no camos, player cards, or anything like that alongside with them. They're just going to be solid by themselves. And I think the whole idea behind that was that these were supposed to be super awesome and coolness. I don't know. Let's go to talk about the first one. Um, it's the panda one, and this is probably my favorite one out of the premium packs, just solely for the reason of the creepy panda on the back. Like, if you really think about it, I, I like the idea of like smashing onto the ground and then someone like almost pooping themselves because the last thing they seen on their screen was a creepy panda just smiling at them. Like, that just seems so magical to me. Uh, it'd be amazing. Ah, that's probably the only reason why I like the panda one. Uh, let's go and move on to the next one, which is the steampunk one. Me personally, this is one that I don't really care for, um, and it's for the same reason why I don't care for a lot of the, the elite camos or, you know, like the elite modifications on the gun. I don't really care for the wood textures, you know? When, it, when I think of like an advanced warfare, it's super awesome, advanced weapons, and I think of like an exosuit from the future, I don't think of like an old rusted third world gun that looks like it's made out of wood or a third world kind of exosuit that looks aged and stuff, I don't know. For me, I don't really care about the design, but maybe you guys like it. It's, it's not my cup of tea. Um, next, we have the Hot Rod Exosuit. I imagine a lot of people are going to like this because it's flames. For me personally, it's too, like, 
stereotypical kind of flames you know they got the circles and the flames and stuff it just seems too basic i would have liked something a little more extravagant for me i think i could probably google search like flames or something and find something close to those kind of images i would think on a premium pack they would like design the whole exo to just be amazing something like although i trashed it the steampunk exo at least like the whole exo looked like it revolved around that whole theme this one it looks like they just kind of threw a base model on there and then slapped some flames on it so i don't care for it for that reason but yeah, that's a freaking thing. Uh, let's go and move on to the last one. This one I don't know how to pronounce. Um, Brog. That's going to be my best pronunciation for it. Um, this one doesn't look too bad. I don't mind the bag because it's like that creepy kind of... I I don't even know what genre it's from. If it's like a, a like a Chinese-Japanese thing or like a wine thing or something. I don't I don't know. The only reason why I say wine because like they got those totem poles, right? Isn't that from them? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know my culture. But that thing actually looks pretty cool. Uh, the helmet I've seen, and I've only seen one image of it. I'm sorry I wasn't able to get a screenshot of it, but it was kind of a little res and stuff. Um, but that helmet didn't look amazing either. The whole thing is just kind of weird. But anyways, guys, that's the whole thing there. The prize points, what you're able to get with them and all that kind of stuff. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. Um, really quickly, I would just like to say when I think this stuff is going to be coming out for PS and PC. Um, my best guess for when this is going to be coming out for PS and PC is going to be January the 15th. And the reason why I say that is because the usual way this stuff works with Xbox getting it first and then PC and PS getting it later is it's usually four weeks from the Thursday. Um, of when it came out so basically since it's Tuesday right now and it just came out if you go four weeks into the future on that Thursday it's usually that date every single time unless they do a wacky schedule like um, like what they did for Call of Duty Ghost that may be out that Tuesday but more than likely it would be that Thursday so I'm gonna assume the 15th that's my best guess that's what it's usually always been unless they once again do a crazy thing and delay it some for some crazy reason anyways guys um, that's pretty much the end of the video if you guys have any questions comments or concerns please put in the comment section down below I have will have no problem answering them and I want to hear you guys opinion which is your favorite exosuit and which is your favorite um camo coming from all this the reason why i say that is because out of all like six out of two suits that dropped which one's your favorite and from the four camos that dropped for your guns that's a that's a whole reason there me personally once again i still gotta go with the creature pack all the way i think that just lump in general is just amazing so uh that's my two cents anyways guys that's the end of the video hope you guys have enjoyed it uh like the video if you liked it maybe share it with your friends if you think they'll find it informational or helpful and uh if you're new to my channel you guys can click that subscribe button this way you will get notifications in your sub box every single time i post a new video and just in case those sub boxes don't work because sometimes they don't you guys can follow me on twitter it auto tweets every single time i put out a new video and i'm pretty active on there so that's the best way to reach me if you guys ever wanted to so yeah i'm lucky so all we got guys peace